Hello, can you believe the sitcom On the Buses was released 54 years ago? Many of us grew up attached to the TV screens. I think it would be fun if you and your family sat on the couch and watched this movie again with the entire cast of then and now. Where are these actors now, who made it to Hollywood and who passed away? Find the answer in our video. Bob Gwen was born on April 14, 1932, in London, England. He played the character Jack Harper in the sitcom when he was 37 years old in 1969. We regret to inform you that in 2003, he passed away at 71, leaving us deeply saddened. There's some mighty spasmus perks. If the governor can do it, we can do it. Oh, come on, Jack, the governor don't pinch pain. Oh, yeah? Why do you think they've changed the lettering on the buses to metallic? I go into that telly, I'm sure you'll want to know that I'm actually at Pitlockery at the moment. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yes, I'm there. I'm there for the season at the Pitlockery Festival. Anna Karen was born on September 19, 1936, in Durban, South Africa. She played the character Olive Rudge in the sitcom when she was 33 years old in 1969. We regret to inform you that in 2022, she passed away at 85, leaving us deeply saddened. Roll on. Certainly not. When you got them on, you can hardly move. <laughs> oh, Mum, did you hear what he said to me? Do you think he should speak to me like that? I well, if she's sex mad and she's not getting any, there must be a reason. So I decided to make her as ugly as possible. And the the wig I had actually had a sort of... Rag Varney was born on July 11, 1916, in Canning Town, England. He played the character Stan Butler in the sitcom when he was 53 years old in 1969. We regret to inform you that in 2008, he passed away at 92, leaving us deeply saddened. <laughs> ah, that's what it is, yeah! By the way, they've got two extra brush and he gave you, must have got yeah. out the back here. Well, it's a good and super quality, guaranteed not to lose its... It was, uh, in those days, I'm talking about, Christ, God, years and years ago, uh, it was a lot of money, that's what... Stephen Lewis was born on December 17, 1926, in Poplar, London, England. He played the character Inspector Cyril Blakely Blake in the sitcom when he was 43 years old in 1969. We regret to inform you that in 2015, he passed away at 88, leaving us deeply saddened. <laughs> You're paid to drive buses, mate, not make sand pies. <laughs> Get that cab out of it, go on. Yeah. No, it's a phone now. Yeah. All right. He said to me at the time, he said, um, I'm doing a little thing, he said, after this, a sitcom, he said, a, 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 a preview for one. He said, uh, would you like to play a part? Michael Robbins was born on November 14, 1930, in Croydon, England. He played the character Arthur Rich in the sitcom when he was 39 years old in 1969. We regret to inform you that in 1992, he passed away at 62, leaving us deeply saddened. Good, I like that, very clever. Matching, here, 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 interior, here. wait a minute, yeah. interior. I we yeah. should say something like, um, can be seen any time. Right. What time's it? But people obviously identified <laughs> with it because I remember two years when it was over, I was filming in the East End and uh, this dear old lady in her 80s, we we're having a break. Doris Hare was born on March 1st, 1905 in Bargold, Wales. She played the character Mum in the sitcom when she was 64 years old in 1969. We regret to inform you that in 2000, she passed away at 95, leaving us deeply saddened. Milk! <laughs> <laughs> Will you stop talking about selling olive and think about selling your bike? We need the money! Alright. And that's just right, Arthur. Let's go now. Drive the bus all around where we did it, uh, with a, a great day in the front. Oh dear, oh dear. Yeah. Oh, and it's great. John Lyons was born on September 14, 1943, in Whitechapel, London, UK. He portrayed the character Bird in the sitcom when he was 28 years old in 1971. He is now living happily at the age of 80. This is the best news we've had for years. <laughs> hey, Bill, you seem like he's not in his office. No, he's not here yet, mate. Oh, he is late, isn't he? With our local paper, the East London Advertiser, mm -hmm. and he wrote the showbiz page. And for some reason, about two weeks later, we're having a pint, just like this. Yep. Michael Shirt was born on June 18, 1937, in Aberdeen, Scotland. He played the character manager in the sitcom when he was 35 years old in 1973. 
We regret to inform you that in 2005, he passed away at 67, leaving us deeply saddened. I've heard of five o'clock shadow, but not at nine o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Get a shave, man. You look like a great hairy ape. <laughs> <laughs> what are you loafing about for? Get to work. Uh, I've been waiting all... Everybody is <coughs> exactly the same way. Um, if they're cantankerous or whatever, it's, it's, um, okay. We wait until they're... Bad Ashton was born on February 28, 1931, in Wood Green, London, England. She played the character Doreen in the sitcom when she was 40 years old in 1971. We regret to inform you that in 2013, she passed away at 82, leaving us deeply saddened. Us? Very romantic, I must say. I should have gone straight home from the pub. Well, I don't see what's wrong with it in here. It's quite cosy, and it? It's a nice soft armchair. 22nd of December, 1988, it all changed. And the police came to my door and said, George has crashed. Sandra Bryan was born on September 30th, 1945, in Edgware, England. She played the character Sandra in the sitcom when she was 28 years old in 1973. Now she's living happily at 77. Tonight. Well, I've forgotten that, have I? <laughs> I'm looking forward to it, tell you the truth. <laughs> Well, I hope the film's no good. Then <laughs> we won't have to watch it, silly. Cecily Cornish was born on April 1st, 1893, in Sydney, New South Wales, Australia. She played the character Mum in the sitcom when she was 76 years old in 1969. We regret to inform you that in 1980, she passed away at 87, leaving us deeply saddened. Pale, you oh, know. turn it in, will you? Ah, just the same when you was a lad, always, always pale-faced and thin. Mum, Mum, can I have a cup of tea, please? <laughs> yes, of course. Norman Mitchell was born on August 27, 1918, in Sheffield, England. He played the character Nobby in the sitcom when he was 52 years old in 1970. We regret to inform you that in 2001, he passed away at 82, leaving us deeply saddened. I was just uh, pointing out to Brother Stan here, the shop steward, how the company's profits are being squandered on the governor's jag. Isn't that right, Nobby? Well, uh... Now, don't you start your both. Larry Martin was born on March 22, 1934, in London, England. He played the character Fred in the sitcom when he was 39 years old in 1973. We regret to inform you that in 1994, he passed away at 60, leaving us deeply saddened. <laughs> Why Mr. Blake's carrying on? He don't even seem to notice me. Well, blimey, give him a chance. You only decided to marry him this morning. <laughs> yeah, well, he always was a bit slow. Tell me who's your favourite character in the sitcom on the buses and share your thoughts about the deceased actors by leaving your comments below this video. Remember to support us by liking, subscribing to the channel, and pressing the bell to receive my upcoming videos. Thank you and see you again.